You can't go fended off a strong challenge from Democratic candidate Dana Balter in the 24th district. Ketco leading Balter 53 to 47 percent. That's a nearly 15,000 vote margin. Balter did thank her supporters and conceded the race last night. And in the 50th State Senate District, Onondaga County Controller Bob Antonacci declaring victory last night. His challenger, Democrat John Mannion, has not conceded yet. Mannion's campaign says they're waiting on absentee ballots. The winner will replace retiring State Senator John DeFrancisco. In the 53rd State Senate race, progressive Rachel May won the seat. She beat out Republican Janet Berman. May defeated longtime incumbents. Dave Valesky in a Democratic primary in September. And following the election, Democrats will take control of the New York State Senate. 32 seats are needed to have a majority of the spots at the Capitol. After the election, Democrats can claim 40 of those spots. President Trump holding a news conference today where he is claiming victory in yesterday's midterms. However, there are split results when it comes to that.